But John uh, was brought up in British Columbia. He was brought up in Trail. He grew up in Trail, British Columbia. It's uh, uh, the home of the Consolidated Mining and Smelting Company, and uh, the area around there is kind of burnt off from the uh, from the fumes from the smelter. And his uh, father bought a uh, summer cottage uh, a, a few hours drive away at a place called Christina Lake. Uh, it with a quite a nice piece of property, uh, and uh, it, it had a lot of uh, lovely trees on it: uh, 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 western red cedar and ponderosa pine and uh, Douglas fir. And uh, so he spent his summers in this lovely forest. I grew up on a little, uh, a little uh, city lot in London, Ontario, and uh, but my kindergarten teacher took me into the forest to look at wildflowers. I was, in, I thought that was really nice. Uh, when I was 12, I went to a, a camp on uh, in Beausoleil Island in Georgian Bay, and that there our uh, leaders took us into a, a forest on the island with big trees. And I was uh, really liked that, and uh, uh, I, I guess uh, we have a, a really um, emotional, oh, just plain love for trees. Well, we wanted to buy a, a, a piece of forest, and uh, we looked around and uh, we found a, a piece. It, it was a, a quite a nice piece of woods. There was a nice creek in it, and uh, uh, some nice trees, and uh, we really liked it. There were uh, a lot of white trilliums, and uh, and there were some quite unusual sedges on it. Uh, the, of course, there's a, a lot of but very good walnut trees, big walnut trees. John and I had a lot of fun on it for for years. Uh, we uh, we camped overnight on it at least once, and uh, we just. Uh, and we took picnic, had picnics. We took friends there for picnics, and uh, uh, we'd heard about the Thames Talbot Land Trust. Uh, uh, I think, I think Johnny's Woods was acquired by the Thames Talbot Land Trust before that, and we heard about them through that. And uh, oh, and, uh, yes, and we had made a donation to the uh, Thames Talbot Land Trust to help buy the uh, Johnny's Woods, and uh, uh, Muriel Andrea was. Uh, very prominent in the, uh, in the TTLT, I think, at that time, and she's an old friend. We got, we were uh, frightened because uh, uh, someone marked the uh, trees for cutting, and uh, we, uh, without our permission, and uh, we have a lot of big walnut trees. They're worth quite a bit, I think, and. Uh, we found out uh, how it happened, but the uh, reason wasn't very good. And uh, John phoned the police, and uh, then he phoned a, somebody in London, who uh, a tree inspector or somebody, and uh, we got that uh, under control. But still, the trees were marked with the uh, bright orange uh, splotches, which was pretty frightening. And uh, since we live uh, uh, quite a, an hour's drive away. We couldn't keep an eye on them. And then uh, uh, that, plus the fact that we're started to get too old to uh, look after the place, and our children lived so far away, we decided we, we just couldn't, uh, couldn't leave it to the children. We have to, have to uh, give it to the Thames Talbot Land Trust. Uh, we contacted Don Gordon and it just, it was very easy. They, uh, it, uh, they set up a very nice uh, 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 party for the, uh, for everybody to come, anyone who wanted to come to. They put signs along the road to tell neighbors that there was going to be a, uh, a ceremony for, to donate, for the donation of the, uh, of the, property to the Thames Talbot Land Trust, and uh, a couple of politicians arrived, and uh, uh, it, it was very well done. A couple of big flags and a lovely lunch set up down in the valley, and uh, it, it just went very smoothly. And we were, really, as I, I, I made a little speech.
because uh, John was not able to speak much at that time. But I, uh, one of the things I said in my speech, and I'll say it again, uh, we were, we're grateful to the Thames Talbot Land Trust for taking it on, and uh, because uh, we know they'll take good care of it and preserve the trees. Well, I, all I can say is that I have had very good experience with the Land Trust, uh, and I recommend them highly. For